Hey guys, I'm Garrett Thompson with LH Thompson Company. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. We got something special for you guys today. We're gonna go talk to Clint and Kyle over in the aerospace assembly side of the house. They're gonna give you more of a hands-on look into the day-to-day -day activities here and hopefully answer any questions you guys may have if you're interested in working at a place like this or here with, with us. So stay tuned. Okay, we're out on the shop floor in the aerospace assembly side of things. And uh, today I have a special guest. Uh, this is Clint Jordan. And uh, Clint's been with us for quite some time now. And uh, uh, how long have you been with the company, Clint? Uh, since uh, December 1989. Before I was even born. He's been here for a long time. This is definitely his expertise and, 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 and everything here. And uh, so what is your typical role on this side of the house, like what is what really is this side of, of the house here at Ellis Thompson? Uh, this is uh, aerospace assembly. I just oversee all the assembly work that goes on, do the final inspection of it, and uh, help do the training along with some of the other employees that work over here that've been here for a little while. Okay, and if if someone like me were to come in off off the street and just kind of want to work here and get my hands dirty in this type of work like what would i expect um what's 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 one of the main things that first thing that you tell people when they first come in here but well, the training side is i mean it's it's easy work it really is you will be uh put with someone that knows what they're doing and just listen and pay attention and uh it's it's pretty easy work hey kyle what are you doing over here Link assemblies. So what, what is this uh, assembly called? Uh, link assembly. And all we do is, uh, you know, we uh, put our sealant in here and we press the bearing in on that little press right there. And we do the, and, and after it, it's uh, pressed in, uh, we do a roller swage, which pretty much is just rolling over the material so the bearing won't, won't, won't push out. And we do that, the roller swager, on this uh, mill over here. And is that, that the whole part for the link assembly? And, like that's, like that's, that's a, it. So that, that's a pretty simple one, pretty yeah. straightforward. Yes. Okay, this is Cherry. She's uh, installing bushings um, and uh, you know, we still have to uh, apply sealant on, you know, around the hole on the inside of it. And we press the bearing in, I mean, the, uh, the bushing in. Um, and actually this one, uh, you know, gets a bushing on each side. And then the uh, bushing get honed. And then we uh, install another bushing on the inside of these. And, and actually there's a another bushing that goes here, and then a bearing that goes here. All right, this is Irene, and she's working on this uh, hinge arm assembly, we call it. And, um, and we, the first thing we have to do is install inserts, which is this little, uh, it looks like a little spring but we install one here, one here, and two inside here. Uh, you know, we use this tool, you know, to install it here. And this is a pneumatic tool that we use to install it. Um, um, yeah, to install it here and what we do, we just, you know, put the insert here and, you know, set the, set the tool here and, you know, press the handle and, and it pushes it through and it'll be in here. And after we install the inserts, uh, right now she's masking off this area here and we have to abrade it, Just get some uh, sandpaper, rough it up, we clean it up and apply primer and what we end up doing is is gluing this part 
right there after after the primer and glue is applied. And this will be a finished part. And uh, every job book you know, has, has all the instructions and all the supplies you need to complete the job. Okay. And so, um, so in these- Supplies, instructions. Yep. In these, um, you know, we, we uh, have to clean the bore out first okay. and apply sealant in here and push the bearing in and it's a it's a slip fit the anvil we use for this particular part you can see you know uh one end goes in here and the other one goes like that so you, you can either heat it like you know like that and then it just oh, like that it doesn't like matter press locks it in yeah so what you want to do though you want to you want to line it up first you don't want to just have it have it flush right here. And the pressure is already set up for this one. And and in the job book, it'd be setting up the pressure and setting up this, all this would be yeah. in the job book. Yeah, yeah. And, and you just set that on there and that's the start. It's a safety feature. It's a safety feature. You can't have one hand here and one hand on the switch. So both of them have to be here. And what we do, you can, you know, you want to hit it square. You don't, you know, you want to hit it dead center. So you can set it in a jog mode, you know, to bring it, bring it down, make sure you got it lined up. And then you want to bring it all the way back up. And uh, hit it. Shut it off and and you know, we got um, uh, torque wrenches we use to, um, there's a breakaway torque uh, call out on this. Uh, and what we would do uh, is, you know, we run a bolt through here and, and tighten it. And we got a torque requirement you know, for this that we would, uh, that we just, you know, check it to that. You just make sure that it's not too tight or not too loose. From beginning to end, from when this part comes back from the coating process, all of it's in the book about how to yes. put the bearing in, proper sealing. Yes. Yeah, a lot of resources. Yeah, yeah. So, like I say, everything that we do is, you know, you it, we, got, we got a job book for it. So it's not like, you know, we have to go by memory, and, and, and most of them do have, have pictures to go along with it, you know, what you're doing on, on everything. So it's, it's pretty easy, even, you know, the setup for the machine, like the pressure that you start out with. Yeah. All right, guys, so that was just a little brief synopsis of uh, the aerospace assembly side of the house here at LH Thompson. Um, there's a lot more assemblies than what's going on here today. Um, this is what's hot, this is what has to go out the door, um, but we have multiple, multiple assemblies, and Clint knows the ins and outs of all of those. So if you were to come work here or interested in working in a place like this, it'd be very similar to this. And I just wanted to say thank you to Clint for showing us around, showing uh, us around. Uh, and uh, this, this man, he is wise beyond words and knows so much about this stuff and has been here for a very long time. And uh, we love him here at Thompson. So thank you. All right, thank you. Thank you for sticking through to the end. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave them below. There's going to be a lot of resources in the description section as well, including our website. So for employment resources, be sure to click that link and head over there to, to our website, lhthompson.com. And thank you again for sticking around. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and come back for more.